ATMs, or automated teller machines, have seamlessly woven into our lives, offering easy cash access. Join us behind the scenes to explore their meticulous craftsmanship from raw materials to daily reliability. Hardware, the foundation of an ATM. So the manufacturing process begins with the creation of the ATM's hardware. Well, an ATM consists of two main sections, the bottom steel safe, which houses the cash dispenser, and the top head module, where all the user interfaces are located. To construct the non-electrical components of the ATM, workers use computer-guided laser cutting machines. These machines use focused laser beams to generate intense heat, melting steel sheets and allowing precise cutting. Simpler parts are stamped with a die in the press, and a robotic system loads these cut pieces into a computer-guided bending press to shape them according to the design. Once the parts are cut and molded, they're assembled using spot welders controlled by computers. The complex parts are handled by a computer-guided 3D laser welding system for precise joining. To prevent metal corrosion, the steel parts are dipped in a metal primer and then baked in an oven. This creates the internal structure of the ATM's head module. Preparation of the electronic mechanical unit. Separately, on another assembly line, workers prepare the electronic mechanical unit responsible for dispensing cash and accepting deposits. Different cassettes are loaded into the unit, each containing cash of a specific denomination. Before installation, the unit undergoes extensive testing, including transactions with fake bills, to ensure it functions correctly. Testing, ensuring reliability and security. ATMs are required to withstand various challenges, including physical attacks and natural disasters. The safe and dispenser mechanisms are designed to deter theft attempts. Intelligent banknote neutralization systems are in place to make the money inside the ATM unusable to thieves. The machines undergo rigorous testing, including a shake test to simulate bumpy transportation, a shower test to ensure they can withstand rainy conditions, and exposure to extreme temperatures from negative 40 to 120 degrees Fahrenheit. Heating and cooling systems are built in to maintain functionality in different climates. Software, the brain behind the machine. And of course, an ATM would be useless without its software. Each ATM comes with pre-installed operating software. However, banks may install their own custom software or rely on the manufacturer to do so. Most ATMs now run on Microsoft Windows, although in the past, Windows XP was the dominant platform. Modern ATMs are equipped with programmable applications that open the door to a wider range of functionalities. These applications enable the ATM to connect to content servers, facilitating innovative systems such as video banking. Assembly, bringing it all together. Now, with all the parts in hand, it's time for assembly. Workers in the factory carefully assemble all the components, including the power unit and the ATM computer. They lower the head module onto the steel safe, forming the basic structure of the ATM. The ATM's walls can be up to two inches thick for added security. Inside, the operation panel is aligned and assembled, containing everything necessary for an ATM transaction, from the card reader to the keypad. The keypad also plays a critical role in encrypting users' identification numbers. Furthermore, up to three security cameras are installed to record both the keypad and the cash tray. The monitor, card reader, and receipt slot are also installed as per the bank's requirements. Some ATMs include a separate module responsible for managing cash deposits, featuring cash-out slots for accepting deposits. A shutter is placed on top of the cash-out slot, which opens when the machine accepts a deposit or dispenses money. The assembled parts now resemble a complete ATM. How ATMs work Now that we have explored the manufacturing process, let's take a moment to understand how ATMs work. Well, when a customer inserts their card and enters their PIN, the ATM identifies them. If the PIN is correct, the customer can perform transactions, such as withdrawing or depositing money. The transaction details, including date, time, location, fees, and available balance are printed on a receipt. If multiple incorrect PIN attempts occur, some ATMs retain the card to prevent unauthorized access. However, some machines may still allow the customer to change their PIN securely. The invention of the ATM has revolutionized the way we access our funds providing a quick and a convenient way to manage our finances. So, you see, the voyage of an ATM, from raw materials to reliable money dispenser, 
is a testament to human ingenuity and innovation. These machines have not only simplified our lives, but have also evolved to offer new features and capabilities. The next time you use an ATM, take a moment to appreciate the intricate process that goes into making this remarkable invention a reality. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the world of ATM manufacturing. Now, here's a question for you, our valued viewers. What's your most memorable ATM experience? Share it with us in the comments below. We'd love to hear your stories. Well, if you found this video informative and exciting enough, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Futuristic Tech and AI for more captivating insights. Stay tuned for our next adventure into the realm of technology and innovation.